Oof, made from the best stuff on earth. Hmm. The San Francisco cable cars are the only mobile national monuments. Hmm. Rule fact number 23. Mm-hmm. So good. Okay. I am going to start sewing the raccoons together. I'm going to sew them uh, five by five, which should be in total 25 raccoons. So uh, let's get started. Mount. It's me bloody noise. It is. Now, I want to make sure that the bottom is even because I'm going to be trimming anything that's extra. Any excess fur, I'm going to be trimming off. So, let me show that the bottom nice and flush with each other. So Okay. So what I'm doing here is since uh This uh, skin is pretty tough. I'm using the table to push on it and just looping it over and pulling. And I just continue that whole process all the way down. Making sure as I go down, as I keep sewing, I uh, bring all the hairs in. See that? All the hairs are in. Then when I turn it inside out, or right side out, uh, all I have to do is just comb the hairs and you won't be able to see where uh, the stitchings are at. Okay, now when you open it, it's supposed to look like that. And then I simply take a comb just comb it out. You see that? And as you go stretching it, it also makes that line disappear. Yeah. It's coming together. I just have to continue stitching, which is uh, gonna take some time, but I'll get it done. OK. 
Okay. It's coming together. Okay, I'm done sewing the first five cones together. Now what I'm doing is, I'm just combing them sideways. Well, I'm trying to comb in every direction to get the hairs out of the cracks where the sewing is, where the stitching are at. Once you do that, you really won't be able to tell where the stitchings are. And it took me about uh, roughly, I'll say, uh, about an hour to uh, sew all five together. So uh, probably another four hours, I'll have uh, the other 20 sewn together. And then I'll have to sew the five together. So uh, I'll say maybe another six hours it'll take to complete. Okay, I got the first five coons sewn together. Now I'm about to sew another five together. Take part of this top one off because this one is extremely huge. So I'm gonna take some off of that.
so far I'm almost done completely sewing the quilt all five layers are sewn over except for where they connect they're all still separated but um, there's five by five but since not all the raccoons are the same size uh, it ended up coming out a bit weird so it seems like I'm shy a couple raccoons here I'm gonna have to put one more raccoon there and basically maybe one and a half raccoons there and then maybe two smaller ones there and two smaller ones here just to complete it or I could just take that one raccoon off which will bring this nice and even and then I could take that one raccoon cut it in half put the one half here then put the other half there where I would then be just one raccoon shy uh, I'm gonna have to measure it and get the measurements see how long it is on the one side okay so it's at exactly nine feet by okay so I see what's happening the bottom is about five feet five inches so what's happening here is that it's going slightly at an angle so I'm definitely gonna have to go straight and take that off so that one top one definitely gonna have to come off where is it now this is still a work in progress but I will definitely get it done okay I ended up taking the layers and uh, rearranging them because uh, the pattern I had before is just wasn't working mm. as you can see it's uh, seems to be pretty straight here goes all around then here that's where the patches happen so I'm guessing I'm probably shy one raccoon or I could just trim the sides off to bring in even all around. But I won't be sure until it's actually sewn together completely. If you notice this end on the left side comes nice and even. Then on the right side, that's where the they just stick out. And then here, I can either just slice off the edges and square it out or I could just add some raccoons to complete it right there but then on the top it's not going to be as wide as the bottom so what I'm going to do right now is just finish sewing it all together and then I'll just square it out the best way possible Not bad for the first time making a quilt. It's coming together. <laughs> 